Hello there guys and welcome to the gaming in. My name is Justin and today I will be doing the first episode of a new let's play of the game Sacred Gold. It's the first game of two games, although the second game didn't really make it. But let's get started. So first of all, we're, we have to pick a character of course. And we have a few, but uh, as I have already played this game before, I know what character I want to play. So I'm gonna go Wall, and I am gonna call it Feoltenos, as that is my name in probably every game I've played in the last few years. So first we have an intro, and then we'll get started. Okay, so that was it for the intro. We'll get a quick recap. And we're gonna start with chapter 1 of this game. It is a role playing game with an open world, so you can, if you would like to, just travel everywhere you want to go to. The Dream, Shadow, the Necromancer, Conjures a Demon of Bales, The Beast from the Death of Hell is Free. Where am I? Fresh land, this place. Nothing here seems familiar. Oh, my head. Not even drinking three barrels of stout should give me such a, such a headache. I don't even remember why I'm here. Yet, I know one thing. There's trouble in the air. My dwarven nose never deceives me. Maybe it was all a dream. Everything felt so real. I wonder whether the approaching soldier will be able to point me in the right direction to prevent this nightmare from descending on the upon the world of Ankaria. Okay, so the dream apparently, as you could already read and as I told you, uh, there was a demon summon and demons never spell good fortune, so Anthing Western. Death and devils, I have never seen someone like you. Moreover, what, by all demons, did you just crawl out of? My grandfather told me of your race. I always thought it was merely a fairy tale. Dwarves are supposed to be hardened warriors and knowledgeable of machines. Well, King Arnon surely could use all the help that he can get. Go and find Ramada and Bellevue. Tell him that I sent you. Okay, so... Our first quest is to find someone. I guess that's a lot of times the first thing to do. Let's see on the map where we have to go. So, 
this is where we're at and I think this is where we have to go to the book yes so yeah this is my first time of actually doing this on YouTube at all I've never done a let's play or anything on YouTube so it will be an exciting experience for me and I hope you like it just as much as I do I mean it might be a little bit difficult and I know the sound quality might not be the best but I think that if I will actually get a bit further with this channel my friends will all be okay after a while and next to that I mean sound quality is not everything it makes it better but this channel that's the most important thing so I, I hope you enjoy our channel and we just leveled up Let's first get to the city and then I think I will upgrade everything I have and this is good. Oh, that was... That was extremely bad of me. I did not expect him to be so strong. Okay, let's see if we got something. We got a skill, although I leave it at this skill right now. And I guess I'll level up first. I'm sorry guys, I did not expect him to do that much damage. So, will I go for health and physical regeneration or some more damage? I think I'll start with more damage. And let's see, strength, increase my attack rate, melee damage and health points, endurance, dexterity. I will probably not do dexterity due to the fact that I will go mostly melee as I'm on my own. And I think for now I'll put it in strength. Just to make sure I get this guy. And yet one more time, I'm sorry. It's been a long time since I last played this game and I did not expect the guy to do that much damage. I don't even remember him to be honest. But it can happen, right? So, as you can see the dwarf is carrying a big gun on his back. It's, oh my god. Okay, this is better because the guy is almost dead this time. Luckily for me. They do not heal, apparently. I think they don't heal. So, let's see. I think we're in the city now. Uh, let's first go to the well, because in every well, in every city or village or whatsoever, you can get a free health potions, and that is never a bad thing. You can never have enough health potions. I should just saw Victor Homer. Help me, sir. Help me, Amon Sheep. Kill the rabbit leader of the pack. What am I talking about? A local wolf pack is being led by an extremely me malevolent wolf. A dark wolf, which definitely has rabies. Find the dark beast in the forest to the south of the old villa and hurry up about it before any more of my animals get eaten. Will you accept this challenge? Yes, I will. So, I think we can do it before we hand in the main quest. That won't be the biggest problem. So, over here, the blue spot. That's where I have to go. And that's where we can find our wolves. And there are quite some people already. And this is not fun. Like, this is sometimes the disadvantage of playing such a game on your own. If you get too many opponents on your head, like right off the bat, it will give you a difficult time. So, I think you can manage that. It's not like this game was designed to only play with people. Oh, um, we've just found our first magical hiding place. It's very hard to spot, you will see a blink just every now and then, like this, and when you click it, you get a quite precious, rare item. It's not always that rare, but it did give us armor of arsenic, so we can endure a bit longer in battle now. Let's see. I think this is the old villa. Let's see if there's something, maybe. Maybe we can find something. And we did find something. Scroll. Oh, I do not know what to do with it. It can always be useful. 
and we found a damaged jade shield. That was quite useful because now I have a shield next to my axe. So that means I'm even more tanky and I can probably deal with this wolf alone with no problems now. I hope I won't die as much as I think I will. And let's see, there's a wolf, so I think we're on on track. And they dropped quite a lot of items. And some potions. Always useful as I already said before. And let's see. More wolves. And I did walk the wrong way and let's first fight those people off. We walk on. But um well it has already been like 10 11 minutes in, so I guess it's time to go. I know it's a short episode. We're just starting this, so we can't really go that far in. So, um, yeah. I'll be stopping the episode now. Next time I will start at the wolves, I guess. To give you guys a bit more of a view. Nice view. And uh, see you next time.